Hello and welcome to the Heart Chakra Activation. I'm Adrienne Elise. Go ahead and find a comfortable place, sitting or laying down. Just making sure your spine is straight but supported. Just allow yourself to become deeply comfortable. As we settle in for a meditation journey into the space of the heart. The heart contains conscious cells like the brain. Conscious intelligent cells. But we must be activated and balanced within the male and female parts of ourselves. Our heart must be healed in order to enter the sacred chamber, the inner depths, the oneness within us. Just feeling yourself sinking with gravity deep into the earth. Feeling a magnetic pull as Mother Earth Gaia communicates with you. Just allowing her to hold you. Just sink deep into the energy of gravity the magnetic field, the emerald grid, that is Mother Earth. And just feel Mother Earth in and around you to come into peace within yourself. Releasing all cares and worries for that has to do with the past or the future. But this time, right now, is for the present, for this moment. So just letting it all go as you bring back the parts of yourself that are scattered around your life, coming back into center, sinking deep into communication with Mother Earth, feeling your heartbeat sink with the rhythm of Mother Earth. Feeling yourself coming into deep connection with all of the other conscious souls on the planet that are also in deep connection with Mother Earth Gaia. Just feeling yourself release and relax. Coming into yourself, into your body, into present time. Inviting in the energy and power of the directions and the archangel energies of holding down the rhythms of our planet. Just inviting in the power of the east, the refreshing new wind, the south fire, fire in the belly, our creative force. the cleansing waters of the west and the earth of the north. All the points in between and above and below. And just allow these to be pillars of light in your space. Allowing geometry to communicate between these points. Weaving a cocoon of light around you. Absolute safe place to journey and to be present. Calling on your healing team, the most capable guidance, the ascended masters, homeworld people to be present for this activation and energetic upgrade. And just feeling yourself sinking deeper into earth energy, allowing gravity to hold you as you see yourself suspended in this cocoon of light, 
absolutely safe. Just allowing yourself to begin to journey. Paying attention to the area of your heart and imagining that you can breathe prana, air and light from above and below. And see these energies mixing in your heart as you breathe deep into yourself. Recognizing any pain, stuckness, density in that area of your body. Just allowing those feelings to arise. Feelings connected to collective pain on the planet. Understanding that we are moving into a new age where we can do it easier with less struggle and less pain. So just allowing those ropes, those energies that pull at your heart, any energies of guilt or grief from the past, past lives, just let that arise. What needs to clear from your heart for you to move deeper into yourself? And just know that there is incredible support for release right now. So we're just allowing it to arise. Breathing air and light into the area of your heart, allowing it to fill your cocoon of light. as you connect into the central sun, recognizing that you too are a power source as you come into resonance with the most powerful force of all the universe, imagining a connection in your umbilical cord, reminding you that you are light and a power generator and spirit. And just feel yourself sinking deeper into Mother Earth, just preparing to journey. Allowing yourself to float and be pulled along from the center of your head calling for an activation of the glandular system receiving DNA and brain upgrades downloads, reprogramming. It's of a golden color. Sparkly gold. And see the sparkly gold ribbon moving through the hemispheres of your brain. Weaving together the separateness. Allowing the pain in your heart to arise to be cleared. There is no separation. You are never alone. Just allowing it to arise. Just seeing it being sucked right out of your space. Any negativity, any residue, any fear from the past. For in the past, you were programmed that when you stepped into your power, into your oneness, into your spiritual awareness, that caused pain and suffering for yourself and perhaps others. It's just allowing that pain from the past to arise. It's no longer true. No need to keep living from that place in your heart. So just releasing all that pain from the past, recognizing on some level you chose it, and just release. And just sending that picture out to all of your friends and family and to the whole planet for anyone who would like to receive. 
that it's safe to release this pain, this collective pain. It's no longer serving us. Just letting it all go. As you come deeper into connection with Mother Earth, deeper into the oneness. Just allowing your guidance, your healing team to help transform that energy, just pull it right out of your space. Anything that's in the way of you moving into the space of your heart. And feeling the healing continue on separation as your male brain and female brain come back into harmony and communication. And feel in your heart the warm feeling of a connection to the Divine Father and to the Divine Mother despite any pain that you chose to experience in your childhood. Just allow that to arise. Let the pain arise to be released as you come into a beautiful, comforted place of being held in the Holy Trinity that is you, the mother part of you, being that divine feminine for yourself, opening the channel to the universe, to the male, the father within you opening to your power and your ability to create change. And the child part of you, the inner child that is now being healed, just receive that healing on the inner child as you see this child before you. With the very first feelings of woundedness in this lifetime, you're seeing the age of that child understanding what that child has gone through and offering that child love and compassion to come back into the Holy Trinity within and receiving that inner child healing from your most capable, compassionate and understanding guidance and healing team. And just receive, letting any pain just come up and just release. That child does not need to carry those wounds anymore. It is not that child's burden. It's no longer serving us to carry the pain of all of humanity for whatever reason that we've done. Just releasing it off, receiving the healing on that inner child as you embrace them and hold them close to you. Seeing the presence of the divine, feminine and masculine, the mother and the father, there, holding the two of you. And that healed inner child, that child is receiving healing, releasing, coming back into trust. And just allow that heal the child within to become a part of you, to live in your heart like a chamber, a sacred temple. As you feel yourself in the center of your head, the place where the male and the female come together in your mind into glandular system that can open you to higher consciousness. Just allow your consciousness to drop into your throat. Just dropping with gravity. Recognizing the tension, any tightness or tension. Any pain pictures from past lives where you were killed for your light, for your truth, for your healing. Just let all that release. allowing that wounded child of all past lives to come back together into one 
healed soul. And just allowing that to occur. As you feel yourself dropping into the safety, security, and beautiful space of your sacred chamber of the heart. And just move into the heart. Feel yourself being pulled down and through the portal. Just allowing yourself to journey. As we explore the sacred space of the heart and allow for heart chakra activation to occur, just receive and release, allowing any images or information that may be useful in your understanding or your moving forward to come to the surface and to be received as you float and journey, just being pulled along the portal that is the chamber of the heart, just moving through right in the physical heart, allowing this journey to activate your heart chakra, the magnetic force, power center that is your heart chakra that may have been cloaked or hidden not allowed to activate because of all of the collective pain and just allowing all that to release as you go deeper and deeper and as you go deeper you may find more coming up and just allow it to release just allow it to come up come to the surface as you go deeper into your heart any pain that you're finding you don't even have to know the origin most likely it's collective pain for all of humanity so just go ahead and allow that to release, knowing that it's no longer serving you there. It served its purpose for a while, but you no longer need it. So just go ahead and release. Journeying, traveling, receiving, healing, updates, and information. Just moving through the portal that is your sacred space of the heart, your chamber. What does it look like? Where is your sacred space? What does it feel like? Know that you can live here and visit here often. I should just move deeper and deeper. Deeper and deeper you see a door ahead of you. A small door with light behind it and just moving towards that door the door gets smaller and smaller as you get towards it you're not quite sure if you can fit through there just feeling the squeeze letting it bring up any subconscious pain or fear in your heart chakra that's ready to be released heart chakra area the whole region of your chest. Just let any feelings arise as you move deeper and deeper, closer to the tiny space of the heart. Wondering if you can fit through that door. I'd like you to go ahead and knock on that door, just moving towards it. And see what happens as you intentionally request entry to the tiny space of your heart. Just feel yourself being pulled inside. Deeper and deeper. A space of oneness. Where all life is one. Connecting with the elements of ether and black matter 
recognizing the space in between the raw materials, the goo of life holding us all together in an interconnected web and just feel yourself there at the center of your universe. As you seem to arrive in an underground cave, you see a rope and a way to climb up the side and there's light up above. Just go ahead and use that rope to stabilize you as you pull yourself up the side. Following the light, pulling up, allowing yourself to rise. Into this big expansive light. Moving to the light, moving through the light. Until you find yourself in absolute complete darkness. Understanding that you have arrived at the portal of the tiny space of the heart. Seeing the cosmos all around you, the stars just as you would in the sky. This is where you will be traveling from as you journey to higher consciousness. Just feel yourself in this magical place, the portal in your own heart to the whole universe, omniverse, everything, everything. You are. Breathing that information deep into your heart. Filling your cocoon of light with this awareness. Feeling a smile come to your face at your victory of arriving. And that you're called to continue traveling. Hold through a vacuum. Like a conveyor belt, just allow yourself to float and be carried through space to the next destination. The connecting, the full circle as you find yourself with your heart consciousness in the center of your head. The fire, the pine cone that is the pineal gland absolutely activated. Allowing a halo to form around you. Finding yourself in oneness, in your true power, in the truth of yourself. Receive visions of what your life looks like living from this place of absolute autonomy and empowerment of the heart and the head, the male and the female, all together working as a team. And just receive. What does your life look like with an activated heart chakra? What does your life feel like with an activated heart chakra? And again, feel yourself moving towards the light. A big garden gate. And on the other side of that gate is your future on new earth, which you had already decided for yourself. The beautiful plan of the unfolding of your destiny. Just let yourself imagine and feel the excitement as you come to the gate. Recognize that there's a lock there, but it's no longer locked. You've opened 
the key to your garden and your destiny through your heart. And just feel yourself stepping into that golden light that is your future and your earth. And just receive any information or images as you feel yourself in your cocoon of light ready to journey into the future. Recognizing your wholeness and your oneness and that you can no longer be fractured. And the pain of this 3D reality is an illusion just like the reality itself. As you take in the magic, colors, and dimensionality and fluidness of this new earth, the old earth made new again in its pristine loveliness. And just soak it in. as you step out of all pain and struggle and into your future. Just receiving integration, healing and upgrades, setting the intention that you would like to continue to receive, that you would like to continue to live from the space of your heart There is no pain, but only understanding. As you begin your journey back, recognize you can take all of this experience with you. Taking back that excitement of your future, your connection to Mother Earth Gaia. And just Returning back to the present time, back to your room, back to your body, it's allowing yourself to journey home, bringing with you that expansiveness in your heart, your excitement, the promise, the possibility. Let that be real in 3D right now as you bring it back into your body. We're coming with your light this time, just coming back in, taking your time, journeying back into yourself. Just finding yourself back in your room and your body in present time, just breathing air and light into your body, taking a few deep breaths, allowing yourself to come back gradually, just paying attention to your limbs, your arms and legs, wiggling your fingers and toes. Coming back. And just feeling that expansiveness in your heart. You can bring that back and share it with the world, giving permission to the people around you to also live in their heart. You should just feel that cosmic light radiating from you. Like a light with a source unseen but you know the source, it's that light in your heart. We are opening up in sweet surrender to the luminous love light of the one. We are opening up in sweet surrender to the luminous love light of the one. We are opening 
We are opening, we are opening, we are opening. Blessings on your journey through the heart. Wish you the best. Namaste.